Now, ladies and gentlemen, we have a very special award. There is a great story that needs to be told about this next awardee. We have never seen any one Filipino person in the modern times to have influenced so many lives in the Philippines and also among the Phil American in other countries. This person dedicated his life to understand poverty in the Philippines. He lived with them to understand why there are poor people in our country. And lo and behold, he discovered that poverty, ladies and gentlemen, is not from lack of resources. Instead, it is from lack of caring and sharing. And ladies and gentlemen, because of this movement, Filipinos have been energized, mobilized, to look back to our country. And please, let me ask all the GK advocates, all of those who have built villages, homes, help in this movement, please stand up. Dr. Kapati, Fremont Red, Tita Pigaos, Abai, Benitez, Evangelistas, Tony, Tony Elias, and please everyone stand up. Ladies and gentlemen, these are the heroes who responded to the call. And class 1976, because of them, tens of thousands of poor people have been raised from poverty. This person that has started this movement has been awarded a lot of honors and recognition. He has received the Ramon Magsaysay Award bestowed by the Rockefeller Foundation. And this, ladies and gentlemen, is equivalent to the Nobel Prize of the Asia. He is also, as you heard, the most trusted Filipino in Asia. He is also the recipient of the community service from Korea. He is also the recipient of the best Filipino citizen of the year. Ladies and gentlemen, we'd like to award this person from our humble association, the highest honor and award that we can ever bestow. Ladies and gentlemen, the hero of heroes, the man who made people dream and made us dream builders. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Mr. Tony Meloto.
It's not often that I'm speechless. But tonight I am. I'm deeply humbled uh, by this award from the people I greatly admire. And I dedicate this award to the 400 years of UST. Now, coming... I hope that this doesn't seem print, but as an Athenian, I feel very much at home in UST. <laughs> Not only because of the invitation of the of Father Rector to be uh, to be an honorary Tomasian, but it is arising from the fact that many heroes that I know in my life come from UST, especially the Filipino Americans who really, uh, who uh, initiated this massive movement. The first 300 villages from the United States came from the doctors of UST. And that is, that is the destiny of our country because I do believe that Poverty will end within our lifetime. And that is a legacy that UST, as nation builders, will pass on to our country. We have a very clear vision. Poverty will end in the Philippines by 2024. And I hope that every year we celebrate. And please stay healthy and alive until 2024. Mabuhay USD. Mabuhay! Maraming salamat, Tony. You have inspired us.